Hi there, this is Rish Outfield, and I'm doing a series of videos where I am looking at characters, Star Wars characters that could be in the new HasLab Cantina that's coming out in 2025. I've been collecting aliens uh, to populate a cantina that didn't exist for about 15 years now, and uh, let uh, just just at random, let's grab a character, and we will talk about it. This guy is called Ellis Hellrot. Now, a lot of times, whoever named the Star Wars characters, whether it was West End Games, whether it was, you know, just loose Scrabble tiles that they had lying around, whether it was a Ouija board, because it wasn't George Lucas, the names are terrible. But Ellis Hellrot. That one's excellent. This guy I like because he's, uh, he looks like Monk's Scream. Uh, and then, you know, he's just a neat looking alien. Very, very articulated and detailed. This one came out in 2007 as part of the uh, 30th anniversary wave, which, or line, which was, the, in, for trivia's sake, the first line where I started buying these characters. And, um, I thought it would be fun to look at eBay listings and see how it's going. You can see the reflection there. Pay no attention. Uh, so the 22, is that 55? Uh, that also includes the part of the bar that this figure came with. Um, I'm not sure if that's going to be worth anything now that we've got a full cantina. But it does come with stools. And I don't think the new cantina is coming with stools. And I heard someone say, that's because the real cantina didn't include stools. You've just imagined it. And the Baron Stain Bears. Okay. Uh, but, you know, there's another one that sold almost the same price, $22.95. And then right under it, we've got $14.99 plus $5 shipping for it just loose without the the stand. And that's still pretty reasonable. Uh, but the thing with this figure, unlike the uh, most of the others that I've been talking about, is it's just excellent. They could re-release this as is, maybe do some more paint uh, so it's less bland uh, in the vintage collection. And I don't believe anybody would complain. Well, it's Star Wars, so inevitably a, a few people would complain about anything. But there's no need for an upgrade. There's no need for a new version of this character. He's great. Uh, and having said that, I live in fear of what people might say in the comments. Let's just cut this episode off now and we will uh, cower in fear. Thank you.